guys welcome back uh, welcome back to my another tutorial in this tutorial guys we will be studying about how to create a custom layer in a part okay so when i go here say part part 001 use default when i open a new part i can see that i do not have any layers over here okay so now in this tutorial what we will be, will be doing is we will be trying to create custom layers okay that we need okay for example datum plane should go into datum plane layer and then uh, coordinate system should go into coordinate system axis into axis point into point how we have to do it that we'll see today okay first close this close this okay then what you need to do is go to my computers c okay then program files ptc creo okay then once that is done okay then click here common files then in this you have to go to template okay in this template you pick the one template which you want to customize i want to customize solid underscore part underscore mmks copy this okay i'll copy this i'll go here back i'll go back I'll go back to extras okay and study in this I'll create a working folder and I'll paste it here okay once this is done close this go here set working directory set it okay open that part okay now if you see here you do not see any layers at all okay so let's do one thing we'll start creating the layers for this okay now remember we are working on a template okay we have to create a template with respect to layers customized layers in it okay so what we will do is first we will create layer for datum planes default datum planes for that go here click on new layer okay don't do anything go to rules edit rules okay feature feature these two should be picked for this then in attributes you go here id not id you go to number okay remember we are creating a default layer for our default coordinate system okay and in the if i close this if i close this okay go back to model if i see here properties if i check the properties for this it says that this is the first feature datum one dot corner system is always the first p feature in a part then second third fourth so go here go to new layers rules edit rules history not in attributes history okay then numbers then you click on from one to one okay then you go here and say add preview you will see this okay remember that say okay okay once that is done then here you have to go again go to edit rules say here and say save query okay now here you have to give your num name t e f a u l t default coordinate system say okay that layer is created here you say okay but don't say okay here okay so your default coordinate system is fixed okay now we'll repeat it again new layers okay don't do anything edit rules id equal to here you go from 2 to 4 okay 2 to 4 and you will see the preview here and if you just say add see preview you will have front right top okay these things go into that particular layer okay go here save query say d e f a u l t default d a t u m s datums say okay say okay here here you don't have to say anything it's done simply say cancel okay now if you see here you have front right top okay now you don't even have to say save the status so our basic is done now after this we have to create a layer for datum planes not default datum planes go here new layer okay then go to rules 
after and then edit rules in that go to attributes okay here you click on datum plane click on datum plane then click on datum plane here here you have name okay then equal to e keep this as equal to okay then what you need to do is preview okay this is very important now okay guys now what you have to do is you have to say is not equal to and click this add okay then click then once again right click add right click top add add say and and okay once this is done say once this is done you have to say come here save query okay say datum planes say okay now say okay here don't say anything over here okay just cancel it see now if you see here there is nothing here okay should to check it cross verify it you pick here go back say okay you can clearly see a datum has been added into this respective layer okay so now delete it okay now we have created for datum planes datum default coordinate system default datums now next is we go for axis okay go here say new layer rules edit rules here you have to click on axis axis and here you don't have to click anything just leave it okay add new add new rules one minute okay no nothing here preview why it's not working why it's not working id is not there okay then you don't even have to go for preview because there is no uh, what you can say no access are available here so go to save query say as access say okay okay here you say okay you don't have to say okay here okay now go here click on this and this and say access did you see that access is available now you can't delete that here you go here and delete it just to verify that we have done it correctly okay save this then go to points okay go here new layer rules edit rules okay go to points you will be available at the bottom points and same thing has to be done okay don't here go here save query say p o i n t s points okay points okay here you don't have to say anything just say cancel when you create a point that point will automatically be added for example here this and this say okay that point gets added over here okay delete it okay now leave it now final thing is coordinate system this is not default coordinate system just coordinate system okay go here say new layer okay edit rules here you go and pick the coordinate system okay and then this is important when you add preview here you see default coordinate system so you have to say is not equal to default coordinate system add it okay then go here say save query and add uh, what you can say coordinates sys say yes say here okay do not say okay here so your coordinate system is set here create one coordinate system see if it gets added into it it goes and sits in here okay so delete it okay then delete it so you it is removed from that particular coordinate system you only have one coordinate system here so what we have done is some basic uh, datums have been taken into consideration to create your custom layers now once this is done 
once this is done the most important thing that you need to do is okay that most important thing that you need to do is go to your working directory where is your working directory study working directory okay purge it this is very important you need to purge it every time you save a number of data will be created uh, versions will be created so purge it so say p u r g e purge e x i t exit once this is done what you need to do go to that particular file okay then rename it okay what you need to do is take it take a backup save a backup okay well in working directory only you create one more folder take the backup of that save it go here go there rename this to new new okay copy this go back please go back to your program files ptc creo3 m010 common files okay then go to templates and paste it here okay you just paste it here at the it will come at the bottom okay once this is done close this okay now what you need to do is go here and go to options configure here you have something called as template how you got that go here click on template m p l a t e template find in this you have all the templates of all the various parts go to bottom here you will say template solid you need to add it to this config file i have done it click on this browse your latest so, uh, template that is here common files program files ptc where is ptc creo m010 common files templates and then your new template where is that new template I pasted it here solid part I pasted it here where it went not all points uh, uh, uh. you need to search this one okay otherwise if you don't find it okay not a problem what you need to do is where you created that file there you can go where working folder okay extras then study working folder here then you cl click on this and say open okay so you need to tell that 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 your config file will pick the template for solid part from the place where you have kept your latest template file with customized coordinate systems then say okay okay and save the config file done now close this okay say erase create a new one see use default template that this should be on and say okay when you go here everything will be ready okay you create an access access gets added up here okay you create a plane and a plane gets added up here automatically okay you create a point uh, here a point gets added up automatically okay similarly everything will be added up okay so this is how it has done i hope uh, you got to learn something from this i have worked very hard to create this because i it took me a lot of time to understand how to create all the uh, all the custom layers okay everything okay so guys uh, i hope you enjoyed and uh, if you like this please subscribe okay thank you